If you watch the NBA, have you ever seen someone with a red jersey and the number 23 on the back? If you don't know who that is, just give it a guess. Who do you think that is? If you guess Michael Jordan, you're exactly correct and that's who this book is about. Today I'm going to review the book, Who is the Man in the Air? Michael Jordan by Gabe Soria and illustrated by Brittany Williams. This book isn't about Michael Jordan's life, but about a single game known famously as the flu game on June 11th, 1997 between the Chicago Bulls and the Utah Jazz. So the Utah Jazz and the Chicago Bulls, they were neck and neck. So the first two games of the NBA Finals, the Bulls had won and the first two and the, and the second two games of the NBA Finals, the Jazz had won. Whoever won this game would end up winning the NBA title. Sadly, the Chicago Bulls had to had to deliver terrible news. Michael Jordan was sick, meaning they might have a disadvantage and they might not win the game. But every single news reporter said Jordan was not going to make it. But he surprised just about everyone turning it upside down by actually making it to the game. For the first three quarters, the Utah Jazz was deeply in the lead. But then towards the end, 87-87, they were tied. Jordan scored the last three points, making it 90, but the Utah Jazz had only scored one point, which didn't help, meaning the Bulls won and took the lead by just two points. That would be crazy. During the game, when Jordan was taking breaks, he was sweating, he was exhausted, he was dehydrated, like everything was going wrong just because of the sickness. But. He didn't give up. He just didn't throw in the towel and stop. He was determined and made it through. When someone asked him, how are you feeling, Mike? And then his response, I'm tired. And that was him when he was taking a break. But he used his determination, every single bit of his energy, just to get through the game and win it. So Michael Jordan, all together during the game, had scored a crazy 38 points. He had flu-like symptoms. And that's when he was sick. Like, he had symptoms that were kind of like when you have the flu. I've had the flu once. I'm like, it's crazy. It is terrible. You can, you can barely move without getting super exhausted. And like, he actually, with all that sickness, he managed to get through and win the game with 38 points, a crazy 90 to 88, two point difference. And he got the, the Chicago Bulls, the NBA trophy. Everyone, go and read this book to learn more about the flu game of 1997 and visualize this entire game because this book is a comic book. It's so much easier to see what's inside because it's, it shows literal pictures of what's happening. I feel like I'm on the court watching the players. It's, it feels amazing. Friends, thanks for watching my videos. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel to stay tuned in on my new videos. I'll fly over to my next video. See you there.